All right, I just went over the uh, testimonials and showed you how to adjust all of these options. And uh, I'm gonna go ahead and do the same thing for services so you, have, you can see uh, how they work. So let's go ahead and start in services and add a service. And let's call this sample service one. Then you can add in your text. You can even add in list items. And let's go ahead and feature an image. So under add media, click set featured image, drag in your image and set a featured image and it will display like so. Let's go ahead and publish that. And again, uh, to add that to your menu, the services page, uh, make sure you have one service or um, of that post type. And we go under appearance and menu. And then again, under screen options, under appearance and menu, make sure you have post type archives selected. Ours is. Once it's selected, you'll get this option down here that you can click and you can add uh, any of those pages to your menu. So let's go and add services. Save that. And I'm gonna open this in another tab so we can tab back and forth. So now we have services. And you can see our service has our featured image here and our text just to the right of it. So let's go and add another service. Adding a featured image. Add in some sample text. Let's go ahead and publish this. And if we refresh our services, we now have two services displaying. Now, um, Let's go ahead and add in the category navigation again. Again, under service categories, you can add various categories. So for instance, services, you can have something like dental services and uh, surgery services. And then you can just edit your posts and make sure you add them to one of the categories or multiple categories. So that's what I'm doing right there. And now under services, if you refresh it, you'll get the navigation. So obviously if you don't want the navigation, just remove the categories, but it's just kind of a handy way um, of, uh, yeah, of navigating. So uh, just like the testimonials, if you want to adjust the column count, how many posts per page, this sub headline, it's under the customize, so under appearance and customize, look under post settings and uh, you can adjust the sub headline. You can change the image if you'd like. So let's go ahead and put a different image in there. Or of course you can just remove them by removing the sub headline. Tons of options, again, in services, you can have a one column layout. This is the only one you can have a one column layout. If you want multiple columns, you can do so two, three, four in services. Again, you can just play with these options for the various post uh, custom posts. You can save it if you'd like to change, accept those changes. And you can see how easy it is to, uh, to change um, these layouts and change uh, your testimonies and services.